everyone, this is Scott from Forgot to Grow. Welcome to our Game of Thrones Season 8 Episode 2 Thoughts video. Just finished watching the second episode of the final season of Game of Thrones, and I'm just going to be sharing my general thoughts on this episode, which involves pretty much everybody in Game of Thrones getting ready for the big battle that's going to be going down what seemingly next week. It's the night they get word that the, uh, the White Walker army and all of them are... are only like a day and a half away they're gonna be arriving before at nightfall and so it's pretty much just one night of them just just getting ready for it some of them settling you know old things some of them catching up some characters catching up on catching up because they haven't seen each other in a while but overall this was just a fun episode it was a little bit kind of slow in parts because like i said this is just a lot of them preparing there wasn't a whole lot of action that actually went down in this episode, but it was still fun nonetheless to see some of them, some of the different characters kind of pairing up, kind of how like reuniting or uh, meeting up for the first time or for the first time in some while in this show, particularly Jamie and Brand. That was just a really interesting scene, seeing those two talk over the fact that, you know, Jamie pushed him out of a freaking tower and how they're both very different people than when that happened. Eight years ago in our world i don't know exactly how much time has passed in the game of thrones world i don't know if it's that same parallel of time but uh that was just an interesting one to get just because it's like we haven't seen those two since like i don't think we've seen those two talk at all since that first episode um or that first season i can't remember if this was the very first episode i think it was the first episode he gets pushed out the window anyways uh but yeah that was one of the fun combo uh, character kind of combos another fun character combo was songs uh and uh, Daenerys kind of finally starting to try to put, like, bury the hatchet a little bit, but then it all kind of hinges on the fact that, you know, Daenerys wants all the Seven Kingdoms, and that includes the North, and as long as it's like, hey, we just got the North back, why, why are we just going to fight for you just to give it back to you, too? Like, we've been putting up with this shit for a while. So I just really like that they're kind of, they tried to get past it, they tried to find common ground, which being John, and that they both care about John, but then kind of being not i don't know if ideolog ideologically different is the right word for it but having like different perspectives on how who sh who should rule what parts of westeros so that was an interesting combo uh a fun part in this episode also was jamie knight and a lady abriana that was just that was just a nice moment for us all in this show you know she gets all teared up i got a little teared up because i'm like this she just wanted to be respected, and it's supposed to be, just, just, it's so nice, and that was Jamie, because those two's connection, they've always had this kind of weird, kind of, not weird, but this very, you know, this close connection between the two of them, it always kind of, like, seems like it's about to border on, like, like, she's kind of in love with him, and he's kind of, maybe kind of, could, maybe has those type, same types of feelings, but it's hard to tell if it's just that, or it's just a, just a deep respect for one another but that was so nice to see them kind of knighting each other that whole scene of the all the like different characters and the, hanging out in the one uh room with the around the fire was just was just fun these are the kind of things that's nice about a, a last season you kind of start to wrap up a little bit get some of these characters back kind of reminiscing about the eight seasons or seven seasons they've already had so that was really just a kind of fun little scene and then the last last little thing we get at the very end just before the battles about to kick off which is obviously where we end this episode and there's no battling in this one but john telling daenerys that they're related and daenerys kind of missing the point that john cared more about which is the fact that they're related and they slept together i think that's what's got john on the like uh, i'm in love with my sister i think john's a little more struggling than that and daenerys is all that means you're gonna be king and it's like daenerys you're missing the point there love this you guys had sex and you're related are you guys the lannisters all of a sudden so like i just i just kind of love that because you can see in john's face he's like wait you think you think i'm gonna claim that don't you think i care about that you think that's why i'm distraught about finding this news out that we're related <laughs> i just love that it kind of just goes right over daenerys head maybe she's just a little bit more maybe she's a little more on the you know on oh, no, the Lannister side of that thing where they don't care as much about incest but I definitely think Jom's held up more on that than Daenerys was so I just really enjoyed that scene and then it kind of being interrupted by the fact that the battle's gonna start so obviously after the battle happens that's what's gonna be going down after that I was surprised for like one second I definitely thought Daenerys was gonna maybe like stab Jon because she's like wait 
Well, honey, only you and your brother and your best friend know? Hmm. And they're alone down there. He turns at one point. I thought she was going to take it. This is Game of Thrones. I'm always ready for somebody to get stabbed. So, you know, I, I don't think anybody got stabbed in this episode that I'm thinking of now. But I just, I thought there, there was a small chance. There was a small, like, little inclination in my mind. I was like, is Daenerys about to stab John? She didn't. Not yet, though. We'll see. But, yeah, that's all my thoughts for this episode of Game of Thrones. Be sure to let me know in the comments below what you thought of this latest episode. Thanks again for joining me today. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Have a good one.